this week on the Backwoods Boys. <laughs> Your first coin. I will rub a rosy, but that's it. So it's one of those rubbable silvers. Hey there, everybody. Welcome to this episode of the Backwoods Boys. It's Redneck here. Um, this week, we've got another good video for you. Um, but before we get to the video, I have a quick announcement to make. Um, starting this video and in future videos, we're going to start doing shout outs of the week. Um, to enter into the shout out of the week, you have to be a subscriber. And all you got to do is leave a comment under this video or any video. Um, and all you got to do is say your favorite prime from the video, who found it. And you are in the drawing for the shout-out of the week. Now, we, we already know that for a while it's going to be slow, um, just because we're a smaller channel now. So we're going to be picking people at random, just smaller channels, until we start getting some comments on um, shout-outs of the week. You don't even have to have videos yourself. You just have to be a person. We'll shout you out, and that's all you need. Um, but anyway, this week's shout-out of the week goes to Dig That Beep. He's a really cool guy. I've been talking to him for a few days. Um, and it seems to be his specialty is sidewalk strips. Uh, and he has inspired me to go check sidewalk strips out myself. So I'm going to go do that in a future video. So stay tuned for that. I think that'll be really good, a really good video. Um, but he himself is a really good guy. Uh, I've been watching his videos for a year. So if you want to go check out his channel, uh, the link will be right here. Click it and go tell them that Redneck from the Backwoods Boys sent you on over. Anyway, enjoy this video. Alright, y'all can see all the gear loaded up in the back. Um, just found out that we got permission um, for an 1815 house. I got permission for that one the other day. And it turns out he owns another 1815 house um, right down the road that has been untouched. So, can't wait to do it. I'll get back to you when we get there. Hey folks, so this is the site of this week's hunt. Um, according to the landowner, says that it's uh, it was built originally, I guess, in 1850. You know, as you can see, before some um, additions or modifications were done to it. Um, there is uh, there's some consideration that it could have possibly been a type of business at one point. It's really in terrible shape. It's for sale just in case you're wondering. But at any rate, we spent a few hours here this week and um, we found, uh, I don't know, it had to be upwards of like 50 coins, um, some silver coins, nothing really old, like mainly 40s and 50s stuff. A couple silver rings, that was kind of neat. I know uh, the repo man and uh, Redneck, they were really excited, they each found a silver ring. couple coin spills but a lot of Wheaties I think uh, the first day repo man found I want to say repo man probably found 26 Wheaties by himself it's awesome it's gorgeous I mean yeah obviously it's a fixer-upper but it's gorgeous Let's take a look around back let you guys see the full view here see everything but we actually had um, three detectors out here this week. Um, I want to say once there were three of us here detecting and the other time there were um, just just two detectors going. Here's the back side of the house. Look at that. Holy cow. Right there to the left of that window is a, I guess an old wood stove uh, access or whatever you can call that. It's just really cool. It's on three quarters of an acre lot, so we have a fairly decent amount of ground to to detect. Um, you can see up to the road and down that fence line. Haven't really found much over in that area. Really surprising that we have not found any old coins yet. So for 1815 till now, um, maybe it's a not even sure what the issue would be with that. But um, as you can see, the, the condition of the house. Um, there were some updates done. So it uh, looks like some, some of that, uh, was that shingle siding was put on at one point. A lot of that was either pulled off or fell off. 
and you find a lot of nails. I mean, here's a pile of aluminum, so a lot of nails. So anyway, there's the house. It's pretty cool. We're going to go ahead and get started for this evening. It rained a lot today. It's going to be a little bit muddy, but I uh, hope you guys enjoy this week's video. All right, y'all. So second target, these dog tags. We're going to clean them up a little bit more later, but after further inspection, they could be Marine Corps dog tags. That is awesome. I'll post a picture of it after this, and I'll uh, see you at the next hole. All right, y'all. It's right there. Garrett Ace 250 just dug up a 1945 wheat uh, repo man he's dug two wheaties um, both in the 40s and uh, I don't know what Joel has so far but we've got two wheat pennies um, that's not a bad start hopefully we can get some more the uh, homeowner is a really nice guy and he even invited us to go down in the basement he said don't worry about the holes um, but we're gonna get some good stuff here I just know it <laughs> your first coin you're, see, he's never dug an old coin. I swear it's not a, it's you, not a stinking lady. Do you want to bring it out or should I? Oh, oh I'll, I'll do the other. <laughs> you want me to do it? <laughs> oh, that's then? definitely yeah, shiny. Let's do it. Let's that's do definitely it. some ahead, shiny. Wipe, no. wipe it off. Okay. Well, don't don't rub it that, unless it's a rosy. So, Dad, tell him what you got. Well, so far, it's a dime. Oh, I think I it's, it, it's going to be a rosy. It's silver. It's a yep, rosy. you can rub it. Rub rosy. Rub the rosy. Rub the rosy. I can say it officially. You can officially rub say the it. Rosies. 1958. <laughs> hey, dude, not bad. Silver dime. Let dad rub the back since it's his. <laughs> Hold on. Are you kidding me? You're going to listen to it? <laughs> yep. It says it's mine. There you go. Let me see that. <laughs> so, your first old coin. I don't know how many people have ever dug a silver don't coin. Tell somebody that it's born in the 50s. <laughs> <laughs> Just a rosy, but that's first one's a silver ever. His very first old coin was a silver. And how you many? Know what? How it many people have done that? Solid dime. I told Joel before we dug it up, it, it rang up a solid. All right, dude, take your dime and give me a fist bump. Awesome. That is awesome. No now, it's, I mean, it's a rosy, but still, but still, it's silver. So here you go. Your turn. Nice. Outstanding. Well, good job, Dad. <laughs> So if you get excited about a dime, yeah. but it's a it's silver. silver. <laughs> just collectible. Scan, right. Rescan it. Scan it. See if it's a spill. Oh, dude, it's a spill. Keep Move your shovel real quick. You put the plug in already. It, it might be a spill. <laughs> dude, if your first, if your first coin came in a spill, I'm gonna be so mad. <laughs> it took me like a year and a half to get my first spill. Use that pinpointer. Use the Joel. pinpointer. No, we scratched it with a shovel. You just snatched it all up, dude. Oh, I see it. It's right there. There it is. Looks like a clad. Coin. It's a clad. It's a quarter. It's a clad quarter. Hey, it's a quarter. It's 25 cents. It's a clad quarter. And it's silver. Yeah, no, it's not. I'm kidding. They don't <laughs> come out like that. <laughs> I know. So it's it's 67. Regular. That's just a regular. Oh, yeah. I had a black silver quarter one time. Oh, yeah. Scan it over with a, again with the uh, metal detector. All right. What's your, what was it, 60? 67. Yep. It was probably in the that. same pocket. It probably was. 67. There's a video. <laughs> Alright. Alright, now now it's our term, Charles. <laughs> Good job, Dad. Yeah. There you go. You just pop it in the second one. <laughs> it's worth about a buck. It's about the excitement. Awesome. I mean, I can't believe it was here for five minutes. Good job. Alright y'all, got a coin. Just a wheat. It's only a matter of time before I get on to my uh my silver. Hopefully Charles will get on one too. It would be great if we all got silver coins today. Um so far it's turned out to be a really good day. There's that silver coin. Mm, can't believe I'm carrying that thing around. Let's get on to the next. And this is my third wheat so far. On to the next. I don't, know what that I don't is. even know if it's a weed or not, but yeah, you rub it. It's probably a weedy. Watch be a Lincoln. It's not be a Lincoln. Once we identify it as a wheat, we're gonna move on. 
It's got some crazy designs on I think it. it. I think no. I see that one scent. Thing. Yeah. All right, y'all. Just got a uh, little makeup lipstick thing. Awesome. Cool little relic. Let's get on to the next. All right, y'all. Check out this relic. I am in search of coins, but I'll take this. It looks like an old antique iron. So that'll be displayed or um, I got a family member that really likes these and collects them so I might give them to her but that is awesome let's get on to the next all right guys so two wheat pennies just came out of this hole and listen to this There's another sitting right next to it, so I'm going to dig it and uh, show you whatever comes out. Those are potatoes. I just got that wheat right there out of this hole, six inches away from Repo Man's hole. And out of the same hole came a memorial. This is crazy. There's just wheats and memorials everywhere. Whoop. Anyway, spell. Let's get on to the next. Can you give me a look? I got gotcha. you. All right, we got a coin down in there. We're gonna pluck it. It's probably gonna be a wheat. Oh no, maybe not. It's a rivet of some kind. It's not a. Yeah. Hmm. Oh yeah, she's just a rosy. Yeah. Good. I will rub a rosy, but that's it. 57. All right. All right. You're younger than dads. A year younger than dads? Yep. Awesome. I'm on the board with silver, boys. 57D. Nice. All right, guys. I wanted to put this out there. I found a silver dime. Pops found a silver dime. I had them in my container. When I closed the container, that military ID tag that I found jammed it open, and both of them slipped out. We found Pops. That's good. That was his first one. I'm kind of bothered that I lost mine, but I just made up for it. Check what's in the hole. So it's one of those rubbable silvers. There she is. Clear as day. So now I'm not too disappointed I lost the silver dime. But yep, there she is. 1956 Washington. No mint mark. Oh, but you know what? All right, everybody, so that's the hunt. All in all, it was a really good day. Um, here's the house in the background. You can see it's a really old house. Um, supposedly it dates back to the 1850s, but all of our finds were somewhere between um, the 30s and up to the 50s. Um, so let's go over the finds. So as you can see, here's my finds. We're gonna start with uh, just a bunch of clad, um, this old iron, at least that's what we believe it to be. Just some knickknacks, toy cars, keys, um, a little lipstick container. Um, my silver quarter, um, my silver dime is up for grabs. It's somewhere out in the yard after I lost it. Um, I don't know how many wheats are there, just a few of them. And then we go over to Dad, uh, well, Pop's finds. He got that 1958 Roosevelt dime. His very first old coin was silver. I don't even know how that works. I mean, it was in a hole with a 67 uh, Washington quarter. Joel ended up with two more wheat pennies. Same Hello. as last video. It's two wheat pennies. Repo Man <laughs> tore it up <laughs> on the wheat pennies. What did we say? 26? I think it was 26. Oh my gosh, dude, he tore it up on the wheat pennies. Um, bunch of clad, um, flatty, pretty cool flatty. Um, just some play money, uh, cap gun, really cool cradle bell. They're always fun to find. Um, and then this small, probably a children's sterling ring, but it is sterling. That's really cool. And um, did you say you got that one on video? Uh, yeah, yeah, I got it. Uh, awesome. So y'all are going to see that. Um, 
so yeah there's the hunt hope you all enjoyed the video um as always keep your coil to the soil to find the good stuff happy hunting and god bless all right everybody i hope you enjoyed this video before this video ends some links are going to pop up uh one's going to be right here one's going to be right here make sure you click them one's going to help you subscribe and one is going to help you um go watch our last video so make sure you click those links make sure you go subscribe share the page like this video and stay tuned for some bonus footage for next week's awesome video I. It is silver. It is silver. Darn it! It's a different kind of silver, though. Oh, I, I wasn't I just say the other day. Ring? Wasn't I just say the other day that I've oh. never dug a silver ring? Get it.